Welcome back to Pokemon Ultraviolet! In the last episode, we went from uh, Viridian City, or Vermilion City, to Cerulean City? I, I I get the towns mixed up. But we went from there, we made it all the way to this new place. I think I think this is called Viridian City. I think so, at least. It could be something else. I don't know, because I'm not, I'm not really the smartest. But in today's episode, we're going to be exploring the boat. Now, I said it in the last episode, I was going to, like, I was going to fight all these trainers by myself and all. But I, I can just cut them out if I need to. I, because I really want to show you guys all the items you can get. Like, right here, a super potion, right on this table. That guy is very nice. And also, as you saw there, this trash can had a uh, hyper potion. Very good item. You should use it. Now, these guys are just trainers. So, I'm probably just going to cut this part out. Or hell, actually. There we go. Never mind. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go look at the other areas. And okay, well, but yeah, beating him, you get this item right here, which is an ether. You guys want an ether? Go ahead, fight him. If you don't want an ether, still fight him. It's good XP. Uh, this one's also. Oh, there, there is an item up there. Okay, I'll come back. I'll come back to that. There is an item there. I'm gonna grab. What's this one? Okay, and these are all. The rest of these people are all trainers, so I'm gonna fight them real quick, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, I am back. I beat all the trainers. I they're out on this bottom floor of the ship, and this item right here is TM44, which is rest. I thought it was a different TM. I thought it was Brick Break, which I was gonna say is amazing. Rest is actually not that bad either, especially with like certain Pokemon. Okay. This guy is also a trainer, so you don't have to- I might skip this as well. So I'm guessing it is level 26 that it gets Thunderbolt, which... Now- now I know. But I'm gonna do a quick healing real quick. Hello, can you please let me heal my Pokemon? Thank you. They didn't give me a room, so you know. Alright. So there's a few more doors you can go through. There's this one here, which is another trainer. YOU INSOLENT PUP! HOW DARE YOU BARGE IN! That is like the first time in a Pokemon game where the guy who owns the room gets mad at you. Everybody else is like, Oh, what are you doing in here? They don't even, actually don't even ask what you're doing in here. They just, they just accept it. Plus these things don't give a lot of XP anyways. I got a critical, doesn't matter. Okay, that was an easy fight. 240 XP. Gentleman Arthur has been defeated. Rude child! I wish to be left alone! GET OUT! Okay, sorry. I mean, I did barge in. I, I do apologize for that. Do you have anything to say? No, she just wants a cherry pie. That's fine! You can have a cherry pie. Just probably not in this boat. Nothing in here. There- I think this next room do does have something here. Okay, it does. There is a Pokeball, and there's two trainers. So, I'm probably- I'm just gonna cut these trainers out. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. Whoa, a critical hit? Damn! Okay, Pikachu. Well, that was an easy fight. <laughs> well, there you go. Uh, well, that was that was fun. Oh, so, the item here, I want to guess. It's going to be... An Aether? Oh my god, it's TM Brick Break. Oh! Oh, great move. Great move. Hold on, let me see that. Oh, actually, I don't want to see it. I don't even want to see it. I don't want to tamper or touch it. Get infected with something. Oh, okay, that room doesn't have anything. But Brick Break is such a good fighting I Probably the best fighting move in this game. I would 100% recommend teaching it to a Pokemon. Uh, obviously, there's a great ball there. You saw that. This is the kitchen in, in every single one of these garbage bins. It's a different type of berry. So, Chesto Berry, Cherry Berry, or Cheerum Berry, and a Peacha Berry. Now, Peacha... Hold on, let me check them real quick. Uh, is, it, is there a berry pouch or something? There is a berry pouch. So, a Cherum heals from paral a paralysis. Chesto wakes him up, and Peacha is cures poison. And this is the, this is the berry that we got earlier. This restores 30 HP. So, it's pretty good. And with that, we're done with this floor. We just have to go upstairs now. 
Man, I don't know how much longer I have on this episode, but I'm really trying to get through all of this. So up here takes you to the top of the SSN, which leads you to the boat! And there's a trainer. Now, these trainers, you never even have to go up here. There's, there's nothing important up here at all. So you don't have to if you don't want to, but... I mean, it's free XP. You might as well, okay? Thundershock should kill. Yeah, it kills. And with that, Pikachu is level 26 now. Which means... Thunderbolt. It gets at level 26. Thunderbolt is a phenomenal move. Look at, look at that. 95 power and 100 accuracy. That is insane. That's so much stronger than Shunt, the Thundershock. It's like not even in the same ballpark. The only downside is I lose half of my PP on it. Because, you know, it went to 15 instead of like 30. But who cares when you can one-shot everything? It, does, it adds up. With that, oh my god, this tentacle won't survive. I couldn't, Pikachu wasn't able to one-shot these things. But now with Thunderbolt. Come on, oh, that animation looks so much better too. One shot. Thunderbolt is going to be the best move I have for a, for a little while now. Until like, Flamethrower for uh, Hound Hour. But it, that, that time, the time will come when that happens. And then there's one more trainer, it's this guy right here. But I'm probably just gonna skip him. So I'll see you guys in a second. All right, I am back from the uh, up there. I want to go heal my Pokemon up real quick, just to, you know, you catch up with things. And this guy, I'm pretty sure, yeah, he gives you Snorlax in your Pokedex. So that's a cool little thing to see. So in case you want to go check something out. Ah. Uh... Okay. Okay. There is a trainer fight right there. I didn't think there was any more. Okay, that's not a trainer fight. I think the rest of these rooms are completely useless. Oh, no, it's not. There's actually more trainers in there. Wow, okay. Um, yeah, these guys are clear. And then the last one. I can't go up there just yet. Not yet, I can't. All right, well, there seems to be a few more trainers, so I will go deal with them right now. And I'll see you guys after I beat them. All right, I am back, and I fought all the trainers on this little sub area, except for one. But we'll get that in a second. And these items that these guys were hiding were... Stardust. I'm pretty sure Stardust, you just use that to sell, you just sell it. Oh, not that door, this one. This doorway, yep, I fought these people. Now this one is... An X attack, which I don't use. I don't use X attacks or any of those. So, that was kind of useless for me. And, oh, Jack, what are you doing here? Bonjour! Or bonjour, Sue. Imagine seeing you here. So Soup, you were really invited. How are your Pokedex coming? I already caught 45 kinds of pa- That's impossible, by the way. He actually can't do that. So that's a little lie that Jack told. Crawl around in the grassy areas and look hard for them. Okay, oh, what? Such a weird way to go into a battle, like. The fuck was that? You, you, you were telling me a statement and then you just attacked me. You level 19 Pidgeotto. I ain't struggling no more, because I'm faster. Thunderbolt one shots. This this Pidgeotto has no chance against a Pikachu. Yeah, get out of here. Critical hit too. Get owned. Pikachu's landed like eight critical hits this episode. Fights I had to cut out, it landed like all of them. Oh, that's a lot of XP. Radicate. Mm. Oh, I was gonna I was gonna switch. Oh well. I guess I guess Pikachu can take out the Radicate. Yeah. Thunderbolt. Does that kill? Oh my god, it actually does kill. That's amazing. Pikachu gained 397 XP. That's nice. I grew to level 28. That's not oh, Pikachu. I love it. Kadabra. I am gonna switch though. Hound Hour needs more XP. Because she's gonna be the one that's gonna be fighting the gym mostly. Because Pikachu is not gonna, you know, do much. So we're gonna have to do that. Telekinesis is a very bad move. It just lowers the opponent's accuracy by one stage. And it itself, his accuracy is bad. Oh my god. Well, there goes Ember. Yo, Smog. 
Smog already has horrible. It's just horrible. Bad. It's a bad move. I don't even know why it was in this game. It's just not good. And I somehow landed it first try. That's amazing. Now all I can make it do is poison. It did not poison. Does good damage though. Surprisingly. Oh my god! It keeps landing Kinesis. or Kinesis. Yeah, I, I kind of figured I was gonna miss that. I. S wow. That is such a bitch move. Like, screw you. That is really messed up. I still don't even have Ember yet. Unless I already... I, unless I missed it and it said I actually do have it. Which is probably the case. Do I at least land Smog again? I don't land Smog. Okay, I'm no longer disabled. <laughs> the, you bitch! You just... Oh my god! One day, I had one day where I wasn't disabled. I had full functioning powers of my legs, my brain, and this fucking yellow cat creature, this bipedal, skinny bones motherfucker, paralyzed me again by just changing the atoms in my brain. I can't, I'm just done. How, I, I couldn't even land Leer. Oh look, I'm no longer disabled. Okay, it missed, good. Did I miss? I missed. Let me guess. Oh, it disabled me. Oh, Hound Hour, you have to land this, please. Thank you! Does that kill? Please tell me that kills. Oh my god. Oh! 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 Oh my god, Hound Hour. Thank you. Oh, you're poisoned! <laughs> it does, you know what? You no, know it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. That's fine. It could stay like that. I'm no longer disabled. Good job, Hound Hour. Only for 500 XP too. That was not worth it in the slightest. But hey, what is that thing gonna do anyways? Think about it. Think about it. Charmeleon. It's gonna die right here. Watch this. One shot. Okay, the animation takes a little bit longer than I wanted it to, but didn't stand a chance. Didn't stand a chance. 600 XP. Get out of here, Jack. Hmm. At least you're raising your Pokemon. You know what? I don't like you. All these sarcasms. You, all you did was to paralyze and not even paralyze you. Technically, yes, you did paralyze my Pokemon because he couldn't think straight. So he's paralyzed in the brain. I heard there was a Cut Master on board, but he was just a seasick old man. Cut is itself is really useful. Yep. It'll heart. I'll be hardly. You should go see him too. Bye. Fuck you. I hope. I hope he falls on them stairs. And there's just an old guy right here. Oh, it's the captain. Never mind. Ugh, I don't feel good. Seasick. You're the captain. How do you get seasick so easily? I rubbed his back. And healed him. Dude, thank you. I feel much better now. You want to see my hidden... I... I am a child. I shoot my prize cut technique if I weren't so ill. I know, you can have this. Okay. Yeah, just give me that was fucking creepy. I'm sorry. That was really creepy, man. You chop down small trees. Why not try this? The trees around Vermilion. Alright, thank you. I gotta get the fuck off this boat. <laughs> and this part right here takes forever. Yeah, bye, boat. For some reason, I'm fucking giant. How did I fit on that boat? Jesus Christ. Yeah, that takes... That's 15 seconds of my life. I'm never getting back. <laughs> All right. Well, there we go. We have done the SS and... Hound hour. I know, I know you're dying from, like, you know... Like, poison and all, but can you, like... Can you halt it for a second? But we did it! We beat the SSN! That was very good. Very good indeed. Um, I think I've been recording for like 30 minutes now. I'm hoping it's only 30 minutes, because then I can upload it quicker and I can actually just like, you know, edit it. But in the next episode, we're going to be going to the gym! And since we have cut, we can teach it to our code except, which I don't have a name because I can't nickname it yet. But his name is Cody, Cody Sepp. We also have Mew. I just yeah, Mew can also learn all the HMs. 
Dang, yeah, this, <laughs> this is an odd team, but I like it. All right, but yes, in the next episode, we're going to be fighting the gym and getting that gym badge. But until then, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.